Hello, welcome back. This is Greg with Threshold Media Productions with a new hype tutorial. Um, this tutorial comes from a YouTube um, question, which is, um, would you know if you can put the hype file in a WP widget? Um, now, before I continue, I would like to, um, to add as a side note, um, there's some things in this tutorial that you'll need to um, recall from this tutorial up here. Um, so once we get to that point, I'll, I'll let you know when you need to you know, take a look at this video. Um, but pretty much what a WP widget is, if you go into your WordPress site um, and under your tab appearances, um, you'll see um, a section called widgets. And what these widgets are is pretty much um, a sidebar area of your site. Um, I'll give you an example. Um, on this site, if I go to the in the new section, on the right hand side, <clears throat> you'll see uh, visit our other pages and paint colors for, for this site. Um, and you'll see over here where it's the sidebar you have visit our uh, other pages and paint colors. Um, these are widgets and um, what they're wanting to know is if you can add a hype file um, animation um, within the widget area. Uh, yes you can. I found, I found a way to do it uh, but also um, if you notice these widgets um, if you go to in the news and then say we go to gallery um, these widgets are in the same same area. Um, as I was thinking about this question, I was also wondering if also you can make the widget only show on a specific page. Um, and I found the answer to that too. Uh, so let's go ahead and get started. <clears throat> Over here, um, I have the hype file that we're going to add um, as a widget, uh, which I just created this, you know, from the creators of hype. Um, here's a little preview of it. Really simple. Okay. Um, we'll go ahead and export it, which I already have here, which is the HTML resource. Um, our, I'm sorry, HTML um, file and then the resources folder. Okay, so we'll go ahead and close that out. And I've also um, uploaded uploaded to my server, so I've already pre-done that for you. Um, if you don't know how to do that, just um, go to one of my other previous tutorials and they'll show you. Uh, next, um, this is the page that we're going to add the widget to. As you see, as I said before, this area right here is the same as the gallery and in the news. But what I want is only for the widget that I created in Hype to show here. Okay. So how to do that is I found a nifty plugin, okay, um, the link is going to be in the description. Uh, we'll go to plugin, um, add new plugin, and the plugin I found is called um, display widgets, okay. So just go to your widget area, type in display widget. That'll be the first one here. Um, this one um, lets you customize what area of your site you want your widgets to display on. Okay, so we'll go ahead and hit on install now. So are you sure you want to install this plugin? Click OK. Now, before we activate it, I want to show you one thing uh, real quick. If you go to your parents and go to your widgets, if you look at your widgets that are activated, um, you see you don't really have that much custom uh, customization for it. Um, what this widget does is if you go back to um, to widgets, I'm um, sorry, if you go to um, plugins, um, and here it is, the display widget. If we hit activate, you'll notice um, if you go back to your widgets that um, you have a little bit more customization, which is a show and hide, um, which you can you know choose what uh, pages and categories you want to display for that widget. Um, so what we want to do is, since I have it uploaded already, uh, we'll go to our site, or we'll go to our, um, our HTML um, file, open up in Safari, and we'll go to view, and we'll go to source. Okay, We're going to copy that source. Like I said, I've already copied this on our server, so I don't need to upload the resources folder or anything. Um, then we'll go back to our site and we want to go to the page um, that we want to add our hype file to, which is this one. So we'll navigate to our pages. And my page is here hype and WP widget. And this is where I want to um, tell you about the other tutorial. I have a section here called notes. Just uh, go, recall back to that last tutorial that I showed you at the beginning of this one, and you'll see how um, this works out. Um, so we'll go ahead and um, fly out notes and then we'll add the the code that we copied here 
and we'll just give it a heading so we'll know what it is, which is the hype widget. Okay. And also we want to go down to where it says um, source. We want to tell it where it goes, uh, which is WP slash content. Oh, I'm sorry, WP dash content uh, slash hype slash um, hype widget slash and we'll hit update all right so now that note code is here all right so we want to copy this code copy and we want to go back to our widget area which um, is here under appearances and now um, the widget you want to use is the one that says text with arbitrary text or HTML okay so we want to roll that into the sidebar area okay now before we add this code we want to go to pages for me <clears throat> um, we want to say hide unchecked so we want to go down and scroll till we find the title of our page that we're going to add this to which is um, hype and WordPress widget and hit save alright next we want to do it with the pink colors um, hide unchecked and we'll scroll down and find it which is right there save okay so now if we go back to our page and we refresh it bam those um that widget is no longer there but if you go back to where the other pages are they're still there okay awesome all right <clears throat> next um with our text um what we want to do is we want to copy the paste or paste in the code and then on this we want to go to um, show unchecked and we want to find that page that um, that we created which is here okay and then we hit save and then we go to the page and we'll refresh it and there it is guys that's how you add a widget uh, from hype inside of your WordPress page thanks